Breaking right now off the top of the Fox 8 6 o'clock news documents detailing the state of North Carolina's investigation into the staffing shortage at the Pine Ridge Health and Rehab Facility in Thomasville. The documents outline how facility leaders failed to meet safety standards during the mid-January snowstorm. Fox 8's Daniel Pierce has been digging through the investigative report. Daniel, give us the headlines of what you found. Well, in the 159 pages, these right here are front and back, by the way, we get a specific timeline of where things went wrong, how administrators failed in their roles. And we also get firsthand accounts from patients who waited hours for care, some of them sitting in their own wastes for hours. January 16th, snow piled up on our roads after a snowfall totaling three inches in Thomasville. Nurses and staff at Pine Ridge Health and Rehab on Piney Wood Road did not show up for work. On site to care for 98 patients, one licensed practical nurse, and two nursing assistants. These documents show the faculty had an emergency preparedness plan, but it never got communicated to the employees. This despite the governor announcing a state of emergency on January 13th. Three days later, the chaos started. The day shift staff did not show up. People working the night before stayed to cover, but got to their tipping point. Interviews revealed one nursing assistant was, quote, crying, asking if anyone else was going to come and help, and had a panic attack to the point where she felt she may have to call 911. Patients inside the facility started calling 911 after having trouble locating staff. One woman first called at 519 on January 16th, saying she had not seen staff. They had no dinner and she was wet in her bed. She called again at 8 p.m. stating she still had not seen anyone and needed help. At 8.09 p.m., officers arrived at Pine Ridge and walked through the front door and saw patients crying, explaining they had not received food or medication. The police officer also described the smell inside as horrible. From there, Thomasville police, county EMS, and state investigators arrived and took over caring for the people inside. On January 17th, the Pine Ridge administrator was suspended on January 21st, the director of nursing was suspended. She admitted she was aware of the staffing issue, tried to call staff in, but claims no one answered their phones. It wasn't until 2.30 p.m. on the 17th that Pine Ridge had the proper staffing for 98 patients. Two patients were found dead and two others were taken to the hospital in critical condition. These documents also show Administrators were in contact with each other from 7.35 a.m. on January 16th until 4.53 a.m. when the administrator sent a text telling them to hang in there. You all are a good team. Pine Ridge has responded to the findings and have outlined a plan on correction. There will be a visit to see if the followings of these were processed.